Big Houston area school district's new school year starts tomorrow online and tonight KDISD superintendent along with the heads of nine other Harris County school districts are pushing back against the county's roadmap to reopening schools which were announced just last week. In those guidelines the county says that students should not return to in-person learning until the county drops below the red alert level for COVID-19. The county is currently at that level saying that outbreaks are present and worsening. Our Channel 2 education team is keeping track of every school issue during this pandemic. Keith Garvin live for us and Katie tonight speaking to parents. Keith? Dominique, this is the letter signed and sent by those 10 local superintendents. They make it clear that their goal is to get students back in the classroom as quickly as possible, as safely as possible. Parents and others, though, are a bit more divided on the issue. Harris County's roadmap to reopening schools plan is experiencing a few bumps as local districts are giving the idea a failing grade. In a letter from 10 area school districts, their superintendents wrote Tuesday, continued indefinite closure as outlined in the roadmap to reopening schools plan will be harmful to children. They add, as educational leaders providing for the well-being and educational needs of over a half million students, we cannot support your recommendation. As families take in one last night before school begins in KDISD, opinions vary, but the safety of students and faculty is paramount. I see the point of view, but also I think it can definitely be challenged because there are people who have been homeschooled before and it wasn't much of an issue for them. Maybe it's a phased approach by grade or something, but I think there's definitely has to be um, an end date and a goal at some point. Late Tuesday, Harris County Public Health sent a response to Channel 2 saying in part, HCPH has recommended that in-person activities be phased in until community spread of COVID-19 declines. And so a bit of clarification from Harris County Public Health, uh, also what they are saying tonight, and they have to remind people that Judge Lena Hildago actually has not been given the power to enforce any of her recommendations. The state largely has given the local school districts leeway in when to decide when to bring those students back to class. We're live from Katie, Keith Garvin, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Keith.